if you are here, you more than likely have had the 0x8000, 4005 error with VirtualBox, which happens when you try to start your virtual machine. So there's at least two ways that you can possibly fix this issue. The first one is that you go to the users, your username, VirtualBox VMs, and the VM that you're currently working with. There should be two files there, a VBox and a VBox Pro file. Let's rename the VBox Pro to the VBox file while making a copy of the original one. And once all of this is done, just restart your VM. I do have to note that this doesn't always work and there is a surefire way to fixing it this, which is to create a new virtual machine and then giving it the same attributes like MAC address and such that the previous machine had and then just link the disk that you had for the previous machine to the new machine and start that one. The VM will start normally. If you have MAC address based network settings then do pay attention that you can remake the MAC address on the new machine as the same as the previous machine has because otherwise your settings will not work. I hope this helps.